Self-reliant space settlements in the solar system beyond Earth have long been the dream and the stated goal of many space advocates. But can a space community be said to truly exist before the first child is born there? Can, for example, Mars ever really be a good place to raise kids? Who should get to decide if space is safe enough for children? What are the risks around pregnancy and childbirth off-planet? Would you edit your child's genome to permanently adapt them to a different world? If a private space corporation builds a company town, should it be required to provide health care and education for its workers' kids? Can a child raised in space ever return to Earth? And might the children of Earth someday leave this solar system behind and strike out for the stars. If we want to build permanent self-sustaining communities in space, then they need to be able to sustain themselves, not just in terms of food and air recycling, but in terms of population. And so that goal requires us to be able to figure out whether we even can reproduce successfully in space, produce healthy children, and raise healthy children in an environment that they are not at all evolved for. Giving birth in this exotic microgravity environment what will that fetus develop into? And if that child grows up in a low gravity environment, clearly that will have effect on their limb development, muscular development. In a sense, you're really beginning to evolve into another branch of the species. If a species is in a different environment too long, separated from other parts of the population, and the adaptations continue, they will no longer be able to breed together and you have a new species. So I think that's quite inevitable and that doesn't have to be a problem. That's just a natural part of these decisions. The space environment poses enormous challenges, huge challenges, because our entire existence has been shaped by gravity. I see a fractioning of our pathways where there's a divergence of the species where within three, 400 years, there'll be a population that remains on Earth and never leaves. And then there'll be others that migrate out and become people of another planet. <laughs>